Uh, hello everyone. Um, I'm going to be making a video uh, tonight about uh, deriving the minimum uh, POS expression for some function given, and the function given is going to be the um, shorthand form for the sum of min terms. So uh, I have a function here from my last video. I'm just remaking my video. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and say that uh, f of um, w, x, y, z is equal to the sum of the min terms, uh, terms uh, 1, uh, sorry, 0, <laughs> 1, 2, uh, 3, 7, 9, 11, 13, 14. Okay, so this is pretty much saying that if we make a four variable truth table, um, there we are going to have a uh, one for our output f at terms um, zero, uh, term one, uh, <clears throat> sorry, term two, all the way down uh, to term fourteen. And something incredibly important that I think I should point out for this. Um, f naught of w, x, y, z is going to be the sum of the min terms of everything that f isn't. So we skipped uh, 4, uh, 5, 6, 8, 10, 12, and 15. Um, I, th I think that looks right. Yeah, that looks right. <clears throat> And then um, we, we should know by now that if, uh, for example, we have, uh, I'll, I'll do it over here, if we have x and then um, we invert that and then we invert that again, we'll just end up with x. So uh, let, let me show you that f um, not not of w, x, y, z is going to be equal to f of w, x, y, Z. And I, I actually think that's pretty cool, and we're going to use that um, for th this video to find the mi minimum POS expression of um, the, some of the min terms given. So um, let's go ahead and make the minimum SOP expression for F, and after that, we'll make the minimum SOP expression for F0, and then we'll invert F0 to get our minimum POS expression. And the invert of uh, F naught is just F. So let's start with the um, four variable K map for F. I'll go ahead and draw it right here. Um, just like that. Okay, and we, we have 16 terms from 0 to 15, so it would make sense that we have 16 uh, terms on our four variable K map for F. So I'll put WX right here, WZ, and I'll go ahead and label these. Oops, 1, 1, 1, 0. It, it has to be like this. The reason for this being is that if um, they are not together, then these three uh, columns are not address adjacent and they can't and our PIs cannot be circled. And so we'll have 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. So it's gonna be W naught, X naught, uh, W naught, oop, should be a one. X and then W X and then W X naught. And same thing for down here. Uh, y naught Z uh, Y Z Y Z naught. Um, something important, I, th I think it's worth noting, is that if we have, um, I don't know, some uh, function of f, or sorry, w, x, y, and z, and we are given, start here, we have 0 and 0 for w and x, and then 0, 0 for y, z, and we have the binary, uh, well that's just 0 in decimal, um, so we can go ahead and say that this is term 0. And then we'll go down here. Uh, we have 0 and 0, 0 and 1 uh, of binary. Well, that's just one decimal. 
and we'll uh, do the next one, 0, 0, and then 1, 1 uh, binary is 3 decimal, and then the last one we have 0, 0, 1, 0 binary is 2 decimal. Um, so it's going to be the same uh, pattern for this one, so we have 4, 5, 7, 6, so you notice that these are not in order on the uh, third row, so it's also not going to be in order for the third column. So I'm going to go ahead and put 8, 9, 11, 10, and then go to 12, 13, 15, 14. Um, and I'll try not to make a mistake on this part. So we have a 1 at term 0, a 1 at term 1, and then a 1 at term 2 and 3, and then a 1 at term 7, at 9, 11, 13, and 14. So 0, 1, 2, 3, 7, 9, 11, 13, 14. Okay, we're good. So the rest of these are just going to be zeros. So we're going to find the minimum SOP expression for this game app. Well, it looks like we can circle these four. And we can circle these four. Um, uh, this poor guy is just hanging out here by himself. Those two can be circled, and those two can be circled. So now let's go ahead and find the expression. Well, f of w, x, y, z um, is going to be, let's do this four. Well, we know that y and z all change, so we can just ignore that for this one. So we end up with w naught, x naught. Uh, or let's do uh, these four. We end up with uh, well, let's see, w changes, so we just have x naught, and then we on this one y changes, so just z. And let's see, let's go ahead and do these two. Uh, let's see, x changes, so we end up with just w naught. Uh, and then here we'll have just y z. And then uh, let's do these two. We'll x changes again, so we'll have w, uh, and then we'll have y not z, and then uh, I'm running out of room here. Last one, um, nothing changes. So w x y z not. Okay, so this um, this is our expression for uh, the minimum SOP expression for f. Um, and now we want to invert that and then invert that again and then this invert should be the POS form. Well we can't just invert this and then invert that again because then we'll just get the same thing but what we're going to do is we're going to invert the K map, find the SOP expression and then invert that. So um, move this over here. Uh, now let's make the K map for F naught. Uh, F naught is equal to the sum of the min terms of, let's see, we had 4, 5, 6, 8, 10, 12, 15. Okay, this is where I made a mistake on my last video, so hopefully I don't do that again. We'll make our K map. Uh, that. Go ahead and label everything the same way. So we had W X Y Z uh, zero 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 one 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 zero 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 one 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 zero. So W not X not W not X W X W X not. And uh, this will be Y not Z not Y not Z Y Z. Uh, y, Z naught. Um, and then our terms are going to be the same. So 0, 1, 3, 2, 4, 5, 7, 6, uh, 8, 9, 11, 10, and then 12, 13, 15, 14. Okay, well, we have a 1 at 4, a 1 at 5, a 1 at 6, a 1 at 8, a 1 at 10. Um, a 1 at 12 and then a 1 at 15. That looks about right.
make sure I didn't make any mistakes on that one. Okay, I don't I don't think I did. So, um, this right here should all just be uh, zeros, which should have been ones on our previous kmap. So, yep, yeah, that looks correct. Go ahead and circle all these, and we don't have groups of four, so I'm going to have to start circling groups of two. Uh, it looks like these two are together. Uh, looks like these two are together. These two are together. And these two are together. So let's go ahead and find the minimum SOP expression for this. So we'll end up with F naught of W X Y Z uh, is equal to, well, let's do these two, we'll have a W not X and then it looks like Y changes, so Z not, uh, or let's do these two, uh, we'll have W not X, uh, Z changes, we'll have Y not, and then these two, uh, we'll have, oh, forgot to circle this, we'll have, uh, X changes, so just W, Y not, Z not, and then let's do these two right here. Uh, we'll have W, X not, and then Y changes, so uh, it's Z not, and then last one is this one, so we'll have W, X, Y, Z. Well, now if we just invert that, we will get the uh, POS uh, minimum expression. So we'll have F not not, which is equal to F. And how do we find this? Well, like I said, just invert this entire thing. And what you do on one side of the equation, you must do to the other. So let's we'll start with this term first. We'll end up with W plus X naught plus Z and uh, W or x not or y and then uh, w not or y or z or w not or x or z or w not or x not or y not or z not so this um, f and uh, not not, which I said was f, is equivalent to what we just found right here, which I think is pretty cool because you can't just, like I said, you can't just invert this and invert that again and get a POS expression. You're just going to get the same expression. But this right here is the same function as this, and I think that's pretty neat. Um, I don't think I made any mistakes here. These should all be right. Uh, if I did, comment on the video and maybe I'll put a little YouTube message saying I made an error. Anyways, thank you for watching. Um, I'm going to make a video tomorrow about uh, multiplexers and demultiplexers, which are my uh, favorite things from the Triple E 120 course. Uh, thank you for watching and good night.